A woman charged with killing her granddaughter, June of last year, had a court appearance this morning, and one of the detectives on the scene took the stand. News 9's Angelicia Bruton has more on what he found outside and inside the home. We'll warn you, some of the details are disturbing. The scene outside this home wasn't the only thing that was disturbing. An Oklahoma City Police Department homicide detective says it's what he found inside the home that was concerning as well. After Becky Vreeland's first court appearance, she told reporters three-year-old Riley Nolan's death was an accident. God bless America. But Tuesday, she wouldn't answer questions after the hearing. How did Riley get in the bin? OCPD homicide detective Matthew Finley was on the scene when police discovered Riley's body in a recycling bin. Finley testified in court saying the bin was outside the home. They found Riley inside with her toys covered with two blankets, one depicting the movie Frozen, which Finley believes matches her bedroom set. Finley says a bed with frozen bed sheets was found in the master bedroom, believed to be Vreeland's room. Vreeland is charged with her granddaughter's murder. She never got on your nerves. She never did anything. She just wanted to be there. Detectives say they found dozens of blood splatters throughout the master bedroom, along with what Finley believes to be a timeout area. He also testified there was blood found in the bathroom. Multiple swabs were taken in a According to a lab report, many came back as Riley's DNA. Also, according to Finley's testimony, small indentions were found on the wall of the master bathroom. He described them as small circular indentions that could have been a child's head. Finley also mentioned there are multiple pieces of evidence that have yet to be tested. Raylan's formal arraignment is set for August 18th. The judge will also decide if one count of desecration of a corpse will be added to the charges she's facing. In Cleveland County, Angelicia Bruton, Oklahoma Zone, News 9.